I'm Brian Van, SportbikeTracker.com. Today we're going to do a product review on the all new Alpine Stars SPX Air Carbon V2 Short Riding Gloves. $99 the retail price for the all-new SPX Air Carbon V2 glove. Please understand we don't update the videos for pricing changes, only if the product itself has been fully redesigned as it has in this case. Who is this glove right for? Clearly this is a protective, well-ventilated, short riding glove designed for the street. Let's talk sizing. I wear a 2X in most common gloves out there. I have on a 2X right now in this glove, and I would say the fit is what I would expect from that. Put them on in the house, wear them before you ride in them, make sure you love the fit before you take them out on the road, and give them five or ten minutes, right, just wearing them in the house to see how you feel about it. And you'll find that with these gloves, and I've seen this in the whole range of A-Stars gloves this spring, it just seems you have your hand in there for five or ten minutes, they really start to dial themselves in, and you just feel the comfort just coming to life in the gloves. Let's talk features and benefits. So we have a hybrid chassis, we have textile, we have leather, we have a carbon knuckle protector. And here's something I really appreciate. They have that same palm slider we see in the race gloves built into the glove. It's invisible when you're riding. You don't notice it. You don't feel it. But it's there if you happen to come off the bike and you need the protection that it adds. It helps to initiate a slide. It's also abrasion resistant. Helps to keep the glove together. Really belongs there. You'll also note they're using that fabric stretch panel in the palm of the glove right here. That allows the dexterity of the glove to go to that next level. Instead of having the leather here and it causing everything to pull when you've got your weight on the bars right here, so much more comfortable, so much more dexterity. In between each of the fingers, we have a nice mesh panel that's going to allow air to flow in freely. Leather motion panels here. It is smartphone compatible, touchscreen compatible, so it's GPS phones, it's going to work there. Velcro closure, and they used a nice Velcro here. The stuff's got a lot of bite to it, feels nice. You'll notice too that this cuff seals up completely. There isn't any gap left there, so there are some of the shorter riding gloves where it is not complete. The fabric doesn't go all the way across, and you have a little opening here. You're out riding the sunshine. With that little opening, that little spot can get sunburnt, so this is a good glove that gives you full coverage in that area. We've got a floating knuckle. So when you wrap your fingers around the bars, instead of pulling on the glove, it's just able to move and expand in that area. This has a little bit of a gauntlet to it, right? A little bit of a cuff. So you do have a little bit of protection here for the end of the ulna, the bone, just on the outside of your arm. Over here in the thumb, motion panel, mesh, high airflow, little TPR uh, protector right there. Overlay in the high wear area. All in all, this is a really nice, short, hot weather riding glove that offers a reasonable level of protection that sells at a reasonable price, just under $100.